Ending poverty by 2030 requires us to be vigilant against threats to the growth of the global economy. We've been fully engaged lately in fighting two of these global threats, the Ebola epidemic and climate change. We're likely to see more cases in more countries. And we have to work now so that this is not the world's next case. I say today, a free is available now. We need to make sure that bodies are promptly removed from the streets of our cities. So we can, with uh, under 48 hours, guarantee the evacuation of international medical staff. Crucial for more people to go. And we have written everything down and we will hold you to it. Thank you. Uh, we heard this morning from the European Commission and from the United States that both of, uh, of uh, those groups have now committed to medically evacuating uh, uh, health workers and other workers, uh, the responders. The World Bank Group's financing uh, for infrastructure will reach close to $24 billion in fiscal year 2014, nearly 40 percent of our total commitments. But our loans and projects will fall far short of what the developing world needs. We are very proud to have announced the creation of the Global Infrastructure Facility. The reason we need this is that um, private infrastructure investment in emerging markets has actually dropped from 186 billion in 2012 to 150 billion in 2013. The key is to work together to overcome the gulf that currently exists between infrastructure needs in developing countries on the one hand uh, and the untapped sources of private funds that could be available to meet those demands. Today, the World Bank Group is pledging $50 million uh, to help improve access to safe water and sanitation for all Haitians aimed at preventing waterborne diseases. In our march to end extreme poverty, conflict, typhoons, floods, droughts, financial shocks and epidemics may at times slow us but they will not stop us. The bank will be aggressive and creative and apply large-scale solutions to help states manage, prepare for, recover from, and ultimately conquer these risks so that they can grow and flourish. It's OK. <laughs> Thank you. Where is the place in which we were born, or where do we come from? We are all wanting to change the world. Okay.